Excuse me, Hare Krishna, would you like a holy cookie? Hare Krishna, would you like a cookie? It's spiritual. Hare Krishna, would you like a cookie? Okay, get a job. Ram is a Hare Krishna. Megan is a materialist. I don't feel obligated to worship God. I'm trying to make her devotee, but it's complicated. Reincarnation? What, what, that exists. I know I was a woman in my past life. Shut up. <laughs> Must be Patty for I have I'm dating a religious zealot. Oi vey, not a rabbi. I, I, I can't deal with this. Your, your movement, your, your personal God. You're missing out on everything. God is everything. What am I missing? Going to bed with you? A slap in argument? How romantic. For God's sake, Meg, go after him. Give him what he wants. What he wants is to be celibate. You know I'm into celibacy, right? I know you're into her. Do you think he's after your money? No, he doesn't even know I have money. You're sure he doesn't know who you are? I don't even know who I am. China Shringer Day Productions presents a spiritual adventure story about the most unlikely couple in the whole world to ever fall in love. Experience the serendipitous, funny, and exciting arrangements only Krishna could make to bring these two New York soulmates together again in a post-reincarnation, gender-change blues, romantic comedy. I want to have a Krishna-conscious family. How you guys know this? How's life, life regression? regression. Yeah. What are you, some kind of sage in the forest? I mean, even those guys have wives, right? He says I'm a soul. We're actually spirit souls inside the body. You have to read Bhagavad Gita. Jerk! Why did you wait so long to ask? Well, technically, see, I didn't ask. <laughs> I just don't know if it's love or illusion. Just an illusion. Keep you in the material world. You're never going to find another girl like this. I love you. You hate me. You think I could really, really be married? Yeah. If you can be celibate in Chelsea, you can do anything. Celibate!